very fast. So you can do experiments like, this truck doesn't play very good. Let's try to move away this mountain, this rocks, this wood. So it allows you to test, to test your concepts in a very quick way. So you can move and change the focus of some asset or even the whole game somehow shift it towards some direction very quickly. And in racing games, it's very important because everything is connected. The handling is not independent from the tracks. It's not independent from the kind of environments you're trying to create. It's everything connected. So you have to strike a balance. And if you want to change, all things need to change together. Wow. Well, I said I didn't know that about racing. I would never thought of that. I've never thought of that. Yeah. That's incredible. Well, exactly. you make these things. You make these, right? Yeah, because let's say you're running in Alaska. Right. Uh, Alaska, it's supposed to be like woods, uh, low vegetation, rivers. Right. Uh, if you want to make, a, I don't know, a stage where you cross rivers and, and you jump uh, out and in the water and it doesn't play very good, you have to modify something like the terrain shape or change the route, and it involves lots of changes. Or maybe you're going to tweak the physics to make it uh, handle better on, wow. on, on the bumps. So you have lots of options, and usually you have to use all of them together. So that's a lot of work in there. That is a lot of work. How long does it take to make this the, the right stage, the uh, right level? We've started experimenting lights a couple of years ago. A couple then, of years ago? Yeah, what? because we had to get in what? touch with the engine. So it oh, was a complete I novelty see. for us. So we started with experiments, then we started to porting our current assets inside as a test, and then we started developing completely fresh new assets for this game. So lots of time. So how many tracks will it be there in the game? We've got uh, four disciplines, 18 locations, and uh -huh. 65 tracks. For example, Alaska or Namibia will host 10 tracks each because it's a huge patch of ground where you can, uh, the designers will draw different uh, track layouts, so maybe you can pass from some nice uh, hot spot, like, I don't know, a waterfall, and you don't enter in there right now, but later on in another race, you pass on it. So the different layouts in there. Then we have the, the rally cross uh, uh, stages. There are nine of them. There are the wild rushes, and there are so 65 tracks and more than 70 cars about. That's yeah, that's so plethora see, that's why of this options. Game took so long right. to make. Yeah, that's a ton and combine it with the different weather conditions and light and, and hours of the mm -hmm. day. So the, the the number of combinations is quite huge, and that's why Unreal helps to keep everything in control. Okay, so I'm the type of guy that when I sit down to a game, I like to max it out and get 100% out of it. How many hours would I have to sacrifice to uh, get that? Usually, the career modes uh, tend to last 